Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, yeah, today I was kind of thinking we should do something just in free build and kind of, well, okay, sorry guys, um, this was just a bicycle I was having fun with earlier. Yeah, um, yeah, I think I tried to make it fly and stuff. I don't even know. I don't know, man. This is, this is just weird. Anyhow. The actual purpose for today was us thinking that we should make a new aircraft and kind of go and make... No, not make a new aircraft. Well, actually, my friend dared me to make the biggest abomination in aviation history in this game. So, let's go ahead and, um... And he also dared me to start it on the P-51 Mustang. So I basically have to make this thing, well, yeah, we'll get to that in a minute. Anyhow, just quickly fix this thing up to actually look somewhat like the real P-51 P Mustang, sorry. Uh, anyway. Editing the wing shape. It was kind of front on the flat. It's kind of. Ugh. Sorry, guys. My words are just not there today. You gotta kind of have a flat side on the front of the wing and then it kind of curves on the back. Just like this, essentially. And then like that. And just like that, it is done. See, that's how the actual P-51 Mustang wing was. Might have been a little indented there, but I'm not going to worry about that right now. Just go ahead and mirror it. And then, yeah, let's give this thing a try. Just see if it works like this. I haven't actually tried this before. Okay, um, okay. Okay, why, why, why? Okay, sorry guys, I'm gonna have to restart that. Okay, testing. Last time it didn't work properly. <laughs> kind of messed up. Anyhow. Oh uh, yeah. Um, let's try this one more time. Oh, okay. Pretty level. Nice and easy to fly. It's not that bad. Huh. I quite like it. I do quite like it. Anyhow. Sample. It's time to put an end to that, and let's get on with today's video. Um, yeah. So, what my friend told me it had to be was, on first up on this list, it legit had, he told me, like he was daring me to do this, and he told me it had to be a biplane. So let's just go ahead and make a biplane right here. Like, eventually... He, in Ma in the newest update, he makes it supposed to be a triplane, I guess. So like, I don't know, man. It's kind of messed up. I have tried this before to see if it's even possible. And, um, I don't know, man. The prototype that I came out with, I don't know if it's ever going to fly. <laughs> I don't know. It's kind of messed up. Anyway, now well, let's see how this one turns out. Okay. Uh, Sorry this is taking so long, but like, I don't know. Once you guys see this, you're gonna probably, like, I don't know. I don't know what your reactions are, but like, 
Oh yes, and if you haven't already, don't forget to leave a like, and possibly subscribe to my channel. Like, I know I'm not a big channel, but like, still. Anyhow, um, I kind of messed up here. There we go. That, that's, that's better, I guess. That's, yeah, that's, that's a biplane. Now. Will it fly? Oh, that's what my problem was. I'm using most of the joystick. Oh, crap. Okay, that does not fly. <laughs> oh my gosh. And guys, this is just so much fun. It's like here. Let's try this. Okay. There we go, we got that one like that. Let's get this one. I know for later versions, we can only keep the tail this high, so let's kind of bring it back. Alright, let's see. Let's see if this works. I'm gonna have to do a few modifications to, until I, like, actually get this thing to fly. But, like, until then, I'm just going to test it, like, every three seconds. Okay, mouse and joystick is the same. Oh, there we go. Sorry. <laughs> oh my gosh. This is pretty good, actually. It's not even bad flight. It's pretty smooth. Okay, let's see if I can use my mouse and the joystick. I've had great difficulties with this before, and I'm having it all over again. Uh, yeah. Mm. Anyway, let's just not do that. Uh, so yeah, it flies, and let's get back to building it. Now, <laughs> surprisingly enough, the next challenge that he gave me is to go and, well, make this thing have hovering capabilities. Okay, but like, that's going to be hard, so I'm going to save that for like one of the last steps, and right now, I'm just going to make this thing a triplane, because yes, he also told me I had to make it a triplane, apparently. I don't know why I listen to people like this, but like, okay. <sighs> Jeez. Okay, so how do I mirror a single part? There we go. Sorry, I'm, this is like one of my first times actually building something on PC. Like, I'm kind of cringy at building, but like... Yeah. Anyway, I'm gonna just hope that this works. Okay, I forgot what that was. Um, that was symmetric. Okay, sorry, I was messing with the airfoil. Don't want to have one one side producing more lift than the other one, eh? That would just be bad. And then you'd end up being like doing barrel rolls all the time. Anyhow, um. Yeah, let's go ahead and edit this wing angle again. There we go. Now, testing it out to see if it'll fly. Huh. <sighs> so hard to take off with these things. They're just so slow. <laughs> As you can see, it's already taking form of an abomination. Oh, I think I need to make my tail bigger. Make it slightly longer and out a little bit more. Uh, maybe a little longer. I mean, I do have triple wings. So if I were to mirror that edge, there we are. Now let's hope that this flies better. Like, I don't know. I don't know. Um. There we go. There we go. There we are. That's perfect. I'm suppressing the graphics on these things though. Cause like legit, look at that. That's so crystal clear. I mostly play this on mobile. I mostly play this on mobile. What is this? I've never noticed. Anyway, I mostly play this on mobile. 
that's like yeah the graphics are okay but like the water isn't this nice type water wait what is that sky park or island dang i really have some exploring to do in this in the pc edition i heard you can also get to the desert islands okay what the heck's over here I'm seeing like a whole bunch of new islands that I've never seen on um I've never seen these on mobile before. Uh eh, probably PC only features. Anyway. The next challenge she said was to basically convert this thing to a jet. <sighs> oh my gosh. Well and it had to be with the biggest jets in the game. So the Blasto BFE 300s, basically these. I had to put these on. It's just like, bruh, why? But anyway, oh my gosh, this is going to be one fast aircraft. <laughs> oh my gosh, guys, you don't know how odd this is. <laughs> It just feels odd. I'm used to making, like, simple aircraft. Not these massive things that are supposed to complete challenges. Like, I don't even know, man. This is just... Wow, mission failed on that one. Let's try that again. Well, that was truly a mission failed. Oh my gosh. This is so challenging too. Like legit. Anyway, it seems like the only there's only one way to properly do this. It seems like I need to have big landing gear on the bottom of all of the um all of the big jets. Like on the bottom ones. Because like otherwise this plane just flips over and doesn't work. Anyhow, let's hope that this flies. Please fly. Please fly. Thank, thank you. Oh, no. Oh. Little unstable, but like it's it's pretty good. It's pretty controllable. Oh, kind of hard to get out of the barrel roll though. But like, yeah, it's pretty controllable. Definitely is controllable. Yeah. Hmm. All right. Well, I have successfully put jets on this thing. Oh, no, that's Sky Parker Island. Sky Parkour Island. Okay, so what exactly is this? I'm just going to go and, like, go into fast forward here. Let's see. Okay, this is even harder to control. Okay, as you can see, guys, I'm running out of fuel. Super, I'm super low on it. And now it's time to test how good of a glider this thing is. And remember guys, this is in fast pace, so it's going to look a lot faster than I'm actually going. I'm currently only doing 126, 7 miles an hour right now. This is ridiculous, bro. Man. And there I go. Oh my gosh. Anyway. Yep. <sighs> okay. And then he gave me one other challenge. Like, he gave me a few other challenges, but like, gave me another challenge too. And this is all on one plane. He dared me to basically post this on, post myself building this aircraft on YouTube. Because like... It'd be hilarious, according to him, anyway. I don't know. This thing definitely does look like an abomination. But anyway. So what it says I need is 10 guns on each wing. So that's 2, 4, 6, 8, 10 guns on that wing. So that... So 10 times 3 is um, 30, 
and then times two is six. That means we are going to have 60 guns on this aircraft. That's a lot of guns. Dang. Okay, so what is that, eight? Yeah, that's eight, nine, ten. Oh my gosh, that's a lot of guns. I wonder how laggy this is going to be. Oh my gosh, guys. Like, I seriously can't believe I'm actually following through on this one. Um, so what am I at? Three, four, five, six, seven. Eight. Nine, ten. There we are. <laughs> uh, it's kind of compact up in the top wing, but like, yeah. Oh, jeez. Oh, there we are. There we go. <laughs> All right, let's try this out. Hopefully, it takes off and the guns don't make too much of it. Oh my gosh. What the heck just happened? <laughs> I think I might have accidentally clicked them. The mouse is a joystick control. Oh yeah. Oh no. Let's just turn to see. Oh my gosh. This is only fast. Oh, this is normal speed too. How about slow motion? Holy. That is a lot of guns. Bro. This is the wrath of 60 guns just firing. Let's see if I can spam it. <laughs> anyway. Um, yeah. So, that's, yeah. Anyways, let's get back to building. So, that, that stage is accomplished. And then, the next one, and probably the hardest. He told me that this thing had to have hover capabilities. And, bro... Like, I'm so glad that they added the helicopter rotors, otherwise I would have been screwed over. Like, he, w he would have still made me do it with these things. <laughs> it's just quite fun. IDK, man. I really don't know. Let's try this. Um, so, neutral pitch. I don't know. I find plus 50... I find 50% pitch works the best. Like, if you have something better, please comment down below. Um, so yeah. Not sure what any of these do. Again, I haven't played this in, like, months. So, like, yeah. I'm kind of rusty and I don't really know what most of it is. Um. Um. Okay, so where's throttle controls? I'm looking for throttle. Activation group. No, I don't want activation groups. Oh my gosh. Throttle. VTOL. I want to use some VTOL. Alright guys, this is going to take me a minute or two, but like... I'm just going to try to figure out how to use VTOL. Again, I'm new on PC, I don't really know that much, so it's like... I don't know. I know that shift is for, um... Shift and control are the main engines. But like, what is VTOL? Do I just click on it and hold it up? Is that, is that literally how I do it? Okay, my gosh. That, that... That did not work. Bruh, that, that did not, that is not working. Oh my gosh, I'm so dumb right now. 
I forgot that I have to put this rotor at the complete center of gravity. And then kind of get a little gyroscope in there. See how it's kind of off a little bit? So you want to put the gyroscope sort of in, in front of the blade just to kind of try to balance it out a little bit. I'm going to try to give myself 50% range on everything and 250% yaw power, I guess. I don't know. I'd like to be able to turn around quickly. But, like, yeah. And I really want my gyroscopes to be stable. And, uh, yeah. Pitch, okay, yeah, 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 I get all that, um, so yeah, I guess, well, let's, let's try this thing and hope it works, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, guys, it's actually working, it's actually working, like, it's not working very well, but it's, it's like, it's flying, it's hovering, <laughs> Oh my gosh, this is so awkward. Oh my gosh, guys. I really have to get, I gotta get some, like, yeah. I'm gonna have to put some tape on it. <laughs> Jeez. Alright, let's see here. Um, before I go mirror aircraft. Yeah, I want to mirror that side and get that. And now let's somewhat hope that that's... I'm really questioning my life choices right now. This will work. I think it'll work. Please don't hit. Please don't hit. Please. Oh, good. All right, let's see. Ready? Let's try this. Okay. My gosh. My gosh. My gosh. Nine percent power. Nine percent jet power. I need jet power right now. Come on. I like legit need jet power. Wait. Do I even need jet power? I I don't need jet power. Really? Really? So you're- you're telling me that I can, like, legit control this as a helicopter, right? I can legit control this thing as a helicopter. It's not the easiest thing to control, but it just had to hover, according to him. I don't know, man. Seems pretty good. And I'm just gonna boost my throttles all the way to 100% and see where this thing- I am not doing this right now. Maybe, maybe I was. Maybe I was doing that. But, like, I didn't know that I was doing that. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> what the heck is this supposed to be? Jeez. What is this supposed to be? Oh, man. This looks like an abomination right here. Anyhow. Yeah, that's about it. So, let's see. Just checking the list here, and oh my gosh, it has to have bombing capabilities. It has to have a minimum of seven boom 50s. Oh my gosh, guys, this is, this is just crazy. Here we go, boom 50s. How am I supposed to fit seven of these on this plane? Can I, can I do this? Can, can, I, can, I can do that too. I can like, I can like legit put them inside of, okay. That, that's easy. I can put them inside of each other. It's not too hard. Um, okay. How many is that? One, two, three, four, five. I have five of them in there right now. Six. Ah, uh, torpedo. Can't use the torpedo. Um, seven. <laughs> there we go. That, that that works. Oh my gosh, I have no idea what the heck I just did. 
<sighs> as well, it has to be able to carry missiles. That was one of the other requirements for it. Oh my gosh, guys. So activate these to activation group one. So that when I press one, my missiles can fire at will. Or they can track stuff. And it can shoot air. And ground. Oh my gosh. Sometimes I think my friend's a nutcase. He's making me do this on YouTube. Oh my gosh. This is just odd. Let's see here. What else do I have? Um. Okay. How am I supposed to do this? The next thing on the list is... It has to be able to land on water. Oh my gosh. Alright, let's just fly this and I'll think about what to do while this thing is in the air. Or something. I don't know, man. This is just messed up. So let's see. Let's see if my missiles work. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Okay, let's try this. <laughs> what? Oh, I, I want, I want, oh, whatever. I want to use my guns. <laughs> okay, then. You know what? Let's just do the other thing on the list. Let's just do another thing on the list before we try to make this thing landing on water and stuff. Oh my gosh, guys. Apparently this thing's gotta have one of each engine in the game on it. So it's already got those. It's already got these, these, and these. So like, what else I'm looking for is like small helicopter rotors. I'm just gonna let these guys sit here and do nothing practically. Just so that I can say I have them. <laughs> how do I fit how how do I fit this on? Um do I wanna do a turbo prop right there? Um Where where would I put where would I put these? Oh my gosh, I just lost that piece. Okay, come on. Near back. There. Um, yeah. Where where would I put this one? Where do I put this piece? I literally don't know where to put that. Maybe if I were to just make like a little offspring from the jet engine, just a little block there. There, that that works, I guess. That that works. I mean, it's, it technically counts. Like, I did technically use that part. And then I need, like... Oh my gosh. Go. Oh. oh. There we go. I have all the propellers. Now I need to add the jets. We have the little ones, and let's go for the bigger ones, and the slightly bigger ones, and then, yeah, why not, let's use the 747 one, I, I, I'm just too lazy to read the names right now, there, there, there we go, that, that uses every engine, nope, not quite, he said, he was, he clarified every engine in the game. So we also need one of these blasto veto engines. I think I'm just gonna put it right there. Just gonna mirror it. Okay. Um. Then I. Then the last type of engine that I would need is a car engine. 
for what reason, I don't know. But like, he said every engine, so apparently I need a car engine. Oh my gosh. So, next up on our list is... To put 20 fuel tanks on. I mean, that's not going to be too much. Bro. I just got an idea. I can attach the pon pontoons to it. I can legit attach the pontoons. Did you see? Watch this. This is awesome. I need a wider, though. Pontoons, I need that about that wide. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Okay, there we go. We have the fuel. We have the ten fuel tanks. One times by two is twenty fuel tanks. And then we need these things. One with a bunch of buoyancy. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, guys. Legit, this is a... This, I don't even know how this plane is going to work, if it'll work. I am honestly ready to bet that this plane will not fly. But then again, P-51 Mustang is the most stable aircraft in the game, so I hope it flies, because one of the requirements was it had to fly. I had to be able to maintain a steady flight with it. Oh my gosh, this is so challenging. <laughs> oh my gosh, okay. Now if I were to mirror that, go, that'll work, I think, maybe, oh my gosh guys, what the heck is this, what is this, I legit have no idea what this is, what the flip, okay, Whatever just happened there, just bruh, why, why did that need to happen? Oh, whatever. I bet you it was because of these dragging on the ground. This should fix all the problems in, in my plane. Um, man, do you see how much those are shaking? I need to. Add some suspension strength to this or something. Okay, come on, bruh. 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 Bro! It's a- It, <laughs> it actually works! <laughs> it actually works! Now let's see what happens when I take the gyroscope off. Okay, so currently, my gyroscope is off! And I am flying! With this aircraft! OMG, I did not expect this thing to work. If I want to, um, never mind. <laughs> oh my gosh, I never expected this thing to work. One thing left to do, land it. Oh my gosh, this is going to be hard. Okay, so what am I going to have to do? I'm going to have to cut the power. Okay, power's cut. And then what? Do I just, like, continuously pull up or something? Or, like, what do I do? Um, do I just do this? Bro. Bro. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Bro. Come on. Couldn't even land on the water. You know what, I may as well just scrap that one, because that ain't happening. I am not landing on the water with this aircraft. <laughs> this thing is just too dang heavy. 
Oh my gosh. What the heck did I just build? There's only one thing left to do. The last step. I feel like I'm missing one that I mentioned earlier, but like, I don't see a point to it. Oh no, I, I'm doing it. I did it. Or I attempted to, anyway. <laughs> Landing on water. That is very hard. Um, and then for this, I want it to be activation group 2. And then, you know, the last thing he said was it had to be able to self-destruct without using missiles. It had to have the capability to self-destruct without having a missile ram into something in it. So that's where these wings come into play. I'll put it in slow-mo for you guys when I'm about to, when I'm about to commit suicide in this thing, I guess. Because <laughs> that's about what it comes down to. Anyway, um... Bruh. Okay, thank you. Anyway, I'll put this thing in slow motion and then you can see what it does. Anyway, um... So yeah, as you can see, it's going like this. So what I intend this to do is when I press the number two, those detach, and then they kind of, well, I intended it on kind of, yeah, there you go. I intended it on kind of collapsing in on itself and hitting one of the boom 50, but like, that that works too. I mean that that works. Oh my gosh, that 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 actually worked, bro. This actually worked. Wow. I am surprised, but yeah. Now do you guys see why I named this the biggest abomination in aviation history? <laughs> this thing looks like a freaking beast. <laughs> Not a good kind. It looks like... I don't know. I don't know what it looks like. It kind of looks like a big... kind of looks like a big chunk of metal that's supposed to fly somehow and somehow manages to do it. But just barely. <laughs> oh my gosh. I have every single engine in this game. And it's got hover capabilities. <laughs> and it's got bombing capabilities. And it can also shoot missiles at you. <laughs> oh man, this is probably the chunkiest plane I've ever built. Uh, anyway, I'm, I'm going to end this video off right about here. And one more thing. You see that little subscribe button down in the corner? If it's red, please click on it. And just make it white. And also hit the little bell to turn on notifications to get notified when when the next Simple Planes video gets posted. Anyway, I'll see you later. And don't forget to like this video. Bye.